Happy Thursday guys, starting another vlog today. Um, I'm currently on a little break from work, just taking a walk. When it's winter, or autumn winter, they do encourage us to, you know, take maybe an hour and a half an hour, whilst it's still bright outside and take a walk. Um, obviously because of your mental health and just getting out of the house especially when you're working from home so I try and adopt that from time to time I haven't been out of the house since the weekend so I said to Bay we need to go for a walk <laughs> so that's what we're doing I actually want to go and check out a skin clinic as well because I used to do facial pills for to five years ago I used to do those quite regularly and I was on snap and there was a memory you know how snapchat gives you memories and I was looking at my skin I was like oh, oh. you know like there's a big difference so I want to try and get back into doing that and that's gonna be obviously part of my self-care routine I don't wear makeup often so I really like to take care of my skin for the fact that it's more important to have nice skin underneath your makeup anyway and just a way of taking care of myself as well so I'm gonna check out that clinic and if they allow me to record I'll show you I'm not sure what kind of um, pills or treatment I want to be doing so yeah that's kind of what I want to go in there for to find out so Follow us as we go on our walk and head to the clinic as well. This is where we're going. Um, the lady I used to go to before to do my facials, she's moved outside of London. So, I'm gonna see if this is any good. Hey you guys, so I'm back home. I put the camera down because it was cold. But we went into um, My Skin UK, the clinic, and I just tried to get some information. We're going to book for a skin consultation because I want myself and Bay to um, start getting treatments there. So we're going to book for skin consultation online, first and foremost. Um, that's what they said, they don't actually accept walk-ins. And then from there, obviously, whatever treatments I get, I'll take you guys along with me. So, I finished work for the day and I'm literally going to chill for the rest of the night. I'm just currently watching some of my faves on YouTube and questioning what I'm going to eat <laughs> because I'm hungry. I'm always hungry, but yeah, I'm hungry. Welcome back because I don't think I said welcome back um, in the beginning. So, welcome back to a uh, vlog, Days in My Life, and I'll see you guys tomorrow. Long time. No time, no. Oh, did you want to put your hat back on? No. Thank you, Femi, for this. And we're live good afternoon guys it is saturday uh, i didn't pick up the camera yesterday <laughs> like i said i would but here we are so welcome welcome back to this portion of the vlog saturdays usually are cleaning days in the house so uh bay and i divvy up the work i tend to do the kitchen and the living room and bay will do the bathroom and the bedroom and he does the hallway as well so I'll probably show you like behind the scenes of that but that's what's happening at the moment it's afternoon we lie in on Saturdays unless there's something going on I'm thinking of taking out my hair to be honest but the thing about it is that I don't want to do my hair which is why I put braids in in the first place I just I just couldn't so I'm just thinking of leaving it in until the designated time when I did want to take it out which was like 
next week but I'm thinking it might now be the first week in December because WizKids concert is coming up on the 28th of November and <laughs> I don't want to be faffing about with my natural hair um, so I might just leave the braids in until after the concert then take them out but if I change my mind then it's definitely going to be a takeout braids day starting from today but I think that's enough chat let's get to cleaning <laughs> I forgot that today is brush cleaning day. I need to clean my makeup brushes. And I wanna do it before he cleans the sink because it makes it makes the sink brown and stuff. So this is what I use. I've got this Star Pro makeup brush cleanser. I just pour it into, I've got this like Star Pro um, container. It comes with, it's a makeup, brush set it comes with this little electric thing that helps you to clean your brushes this is his two AA batteries and different sizes for the brush heads so all you do literally if I show you an example is take one of the sizes that you need put your makeup brush in it like so as you can see and then there's a hole that this little tool goes into right so the whole thing now looks like this let me get a brush that actually fits it properly as you can see brush isn't moving in case you're interested I'll link this in the description box so do check it out it's from Amazon so then what I do is I take the cleanser put it into the bowl If you switch it on, you can see that the brush is turning. But all I do is dip it in and it will just turn itself and clean itself in the cleanser. Anything else I've tried to do, like I've done fairy liquid in the washing machine and the brushes just aren't clean. But if there's anything else you guys use, let me know below. I'll give it a try because buying this all the time i think i bought this big bottle for like 11.99 i use a lot of it so obviously whilst it's convenient i would say it can also be quite costly in the long run as opposed to using fairy liquid which you can get for two pounds the cleanser is oil based so you can't mix it with water because then it'll break down the consistency and elements that allow it to clean your brushes this brush as you can see now look done within two minutes not even two minutes a minute can't be mad at that and this is why i told bay not to clean because sometimes i have accidents maybe same thing i happened to drop this thing and so the batteries came on then, and it was still on so when i pushed the batteries back in obviously the brush it's just splattered everywhere so I said let me clean before you let me clean my brushes before you clean because now look what I done
cleaning done. It's like, yeah, almost seven. We finished cleaning ages ago though. Thanks to Bay. Anyway, he took over today. And now, I wanna make stew. So, you guys know my last vlog, well, I'm saying my last vlog, one of my vlogs I was saying that I cook the meat all at once and then I put it in the freezer because then it's just quicker for when I want to make stew and stuff like that. Bay doesn't. So we'll buy the meat, wash it and then just put it in the freezer. But I feel like this is just longer because now you have to cook the meat, wait for the meat to cook, then make your stew. But he's saying that, what's he saying? Oh yeah, basically the meat stock has more flavour when the meat is freshly cooked as opposed to you making stew and then add in your Maggie and ting and ting and ting. So, right now, we're just about to cook the meat. But you know, by now, like my stew will be halfway done and you know, I'll just be pouring the meat in. But, you know, who am I to argue? This is how he likes to do it. So, gonna cook the meat now, then make stew. So I'll probably just show you that. Um, and chill for the rest of the evening because nothing's happening around here. Tomorrow I'm gonna go see my sister. But yeah, today's really been a house house vlog, like house chores, cooking, all of that, all of that. To the stew we go. Well, actually, first, let's cook the meat. Well, that fire's gonna go. All seasoned up. My sister's house. You can say hello. Hi. Okay. <laughs> so happy Sunday, guys. This is the last day of the vlog. I'm currently watching Tenant, and I have to concentrate. So I might just say thank you for watching this week's vlog. As always, please like, comment, share, and subscribe. And I'll see you in my next video. I have to pay attention. <laughs>